What's up everyone? It's Matt Martin with The Grass Factor. I wanted to do Fall Rivers Get to Know Me Challenge. Uh, first, I want to say big, big thank you to uh, David at Yard Therapy and also Jacob with Scooters Lawn Care. Uh, you know, luckily, I've, I've had the, the, the chance to meet Jacob and what, what an awesome guy he is. And uh, even, his, even his dad's an awesome guy. So I'm excited for what they've got going on in Illinois. I think uh, they're going to be a force to reckon with as, as the years move forward. Um, you know, a little bit about me. I, didn't, I don't want to talk a whole lot about my lawn care career. I mean, it's, it's nothing spectacular. And I've talked about it in other videos. So I just kind of wanted to tell you about me, Matt Martin, the person versus Matt Martin, the lawn tech. Um, you know, I'm, I'm originally from Memphis, Tennessee. Uh, I went to Christian Brothers High School in Memphis, of course, after school, came to school at UT and then back to Memphis and traveled the south a little bit and then uh, and then made it back to Knoxville to, to start my own thing. Um, I got married uh, six years ago to my incredible wife, Asami. Uh, my wife is from Japan and uh, she's incredibly fearless and that's one of the things that that made her and I such a great fit. Uh, you know, she has no fears, and I'm overridden with fears. Um, you know, that that being said, you know, I, I'm the kind of guy that is incredibly. I, I make the joke that I'm a miserable person to be around because I have a very hard time just deciding to do something and then executing. When I make the decision to do something, I go through a period of research, and it doesn't matter if it's a turf product, uh, buying a vehicle, buying a TV, everything goes out on a spreadsheet, and I dissect it, pros, cons, each direction that I could possibly go, uh, the benefits, the drawbacks, and, uh, and I mean, I carry that with me with everything I do. I'm incredibly, incredibly research-driven. And my wife on the counterpart is much more a person of action that if she has a plan, she's gonna execute. And so together, we, we, make a, we make a pretty damn good team. We also have two kids. I've got a little boy named Noah. He's four years old. And I also have a daughter, Lilia, that's one year old. And man, what a, what a joy it is to be around them. Uh, you know, when it, when it comes to hobbies in school, I was, a, I was an athlete. I loved football, I loved basketball. I loved golf, Hello. <laughs> but uh, you know now with with two kids and uh, and a lot of a lot of family, you know that's that's where I, I spend a lot of my time outside of work. You know, of course, I spend time with with YouTube. Uh, you know, time with my kids, my wife. Uh, occasionally, I still love to swing a golf club. Uh, you know, golf is it's probably always going to hold my heart. Uh, I also have a black belt in Shotokan Karate. It's been a while since I've done anything with it. Um, it's it, it, anyway. I've, I've tried a, a little bit of everything uh, through my through my 30 years here, and that's another thing. I'm 30 years old. Um, and I'd say as you really get to know me as a person outside of the lawn care atmosphere, my wife and I we're the type of people we love to entertain. Uh, that's probably what we do more than really anything. I work a lot, but outside of work, I mean, we we have a ton of fun. We enjoy having people over from out of town. It seems like every weekend for like the last four weekends, I think we've had somebody in from out of town, and we always make a big go of it, have big parties and stuff, and that's just what we like to do. We, we love to entertain. We're, I'd like to say we're a lot of fun to be around, otherwise people wouldn't continue to come over and stay with us for a weekend but uh, yeah we we really get after it so uh, you know my wife works she teaches at the East Tennessee Japanese School it's for the students whose parents are on an exchange program so we have Denso manufacturing here which is a Japanese company uh, they bring in engineers from Japan and their families come with them and they stay here for you know, upwards of five years so their children, it's their first exposure to schools in America, and they're being taught in English. So the Japanese government sponsors this program called the East Tennessee Japanese School, where they can take classes in Japanese to make sure they're keeping up with their curriculum 
that they're being taught in English, but you know that way when they go back to Japan, you know they they've comprehended the curriculum that they've been taught in school, um, you know wh whichever language it came from. So I think that's a, a really neat mission that she has going on. Um, and then outside of that, you know, Outdoor Designs as a company, of course, I, I'm so proud of of what we do as a company. You know, of course, I'm I'm a spray guy. You know, we have the tree company, Top Notch Tree Care. And then Outdoor Designs as a whole, the bulk of our work is going to be work we do through the county. Um, it's called the Environmental Stewardship Program. And basically, when people face issues with water in this area, because we average 40 inches of rain a year, um, when, it, and of course, you know, we're in the, you know, near the mountains of East Tennessee, so it's incredibly hilly here, and water is a huge, huge issue. Stormwater runoff is a huge issue. And so as a company, a lot of what we do deals with mitigating stormwater runoff. And so we install a lot of bioswales, rain gardens, uh, geo web retaining walls, you name it, we have done it. Uh, you know, stream bank, stream bank restorations with you know, willow, willow stakes and uh, fascines. So, I mean, we do, we do a lot of really, really, really cool things that are progressive and a little bit ahead of, of what's kind of the status quo in the green industry. So, you know, I, I love what my wife is doing with her career. I love what I'm doing with my career. And um, there's no telling which direction my kids are going to go. I mean, they're, they're so young, but my son is an absolute spitfire of a boy and my daughter is of course the the little angel of the group so anyway y'all that's me that's matt martin uh you know outside of who i am from the grass factor um so i want to take this time again to thank you know david from yard therapy uh to thank jacob from scooters lawn care and i also want to pass the buck on so to speak the big one I want to see is Alan Hain, the lawn care nut, and why I want to see him. One, he's one of my favorite people to watch on YouTube, and two, he's an old true green guy like I am, and he actually got out of the industry. Now I know he still does all the work on his lawn, you know, outside of a corporate environment, but he actually escaped the industry. So I'm curious what he did once he left the industry, how he got out of the industry and how he stayed out of the industry. Um, because most people I know that get out of the industry, it takes a few years, but they're back in it. So I want to know how he was able to walk away from it. Um, so Alan Hayne, the lawn care nut, everybody do me a favor. Please comment on his videos. Let him know I've called him out on the get to know me challenge. I want to get to know Alan Hayne, the lawn care nut. There's two other, I want to get to know Cameron Helton of uh, Helton Landscapes in North Carolina. He's up there near Boone, not too far away from me. He and I need to get together and have a beer. And then I also, uh, I want to see Josh Whitaker with Performance Lawns in Mount Juliet, Tennessee. Does not have a public YouTube channel. Make it public, Josh. Talk to us. Let us get to know you, Josh Whitaker, outside of Performance Lawns in this Get to Know Me Challenge. Get rock and rolling on your YouTube channel. I'm calling you out in a public forum. So if y'all can look him up on YouTube, Performance Lawns. Uh, he is going to be in Mount Juliet, Tennessee. Josh Whitaker, I'm calling you out. Comment on his videos. Comment on Cameron Hilton's videos. Comment on Alan Hayne, the Lawn Care Nuts videos. And let him know I'm calling him out in the Get to Know Me Challenge. Thank you, thank you, thank you again to David Yard Therapy and thank you to Jacob with Scooters Long Hair. I can't thank you enough. Have a good one, y'all.